The next stretch focuses on the piriformis muscle and the other short rotators in the hip. Now, if these muscles are always tight, you need to start thinking that there could be a lack of hip stability. And these muscles are actually compensating. They're tightening up to try and create some extra stability at the hip. But if the stretch works for you, great. If they keep tightening up and it keeps coming back, you need to then start thinking of a hip stability program. But in any case, here's the stretch. You can allow on your back. If we stretch the left leg, you're gonna externally rotate it, use the other leg to pull upwards like that. You can hold the shin and just pull up towards you. And you should feel a gentle stretch in the back of this leg. Obviously, you wanna repeat that on both sides. And because it's a static stretch, hold it for about 15 to 20 seconds. There's another variation that you can do. Now, not everyone's gonna be able to get into this position, especially if you are unable to externally rotate your hips well, or if your anatomy just doesn't allow for it. So the stretch looks like this. You're gonna be on the floor. You're gonna externally rotate that leg so the shin is flat on the floor. And then you're gonna just let your upper body drop down towards the knee. And you're gonna just hold it there. And again, you should feel a stretch in the back of that leg. Don't push it, don't force it. Just hold that stretch again, 10 to 15 seconds, three times on both sides. 